Water quantity and water quality are critical to the future of Kansas. The Ogallala Aquifer is the primary water source for the High Plains region and underlies portions of eight states. It's also some of Kansas' most productive agricultural land. A recent Kansas State University study predicts if current use of the Ogallala Aquifer continues, as much as 69% of this underground water resource will be depleted by 2060. We wouldn't normally apply that much water. For 25 years, K-State researchers have been studying the effectiveness of applying smaller amounts of water directly to the crop root zone. On-farm research consistently shows that subsurface drip irrigation systems conserve water and produce high-yielding crops when they're properly designed, installed, operated, and maintained. As irrigation is reduced in the future by governmental or hydrological constraints, we feel confident that SDI can maintain crop production levels at a higher level than alternative irrigation systems. Things in the world are not happening locally, they are globally. I think uh, in the research, I think that there is a great opportunity to show that investing in technology, they can reach very good uh, results in a huge step. Our group come here and we learn a lot from you. They are best in the world. So exchange idea uh, between different uh, universities or country, I think it is very important uh, to develop a subsurface drip irrigation. <laughs>